first time playing on Massacre. Let's do it. Okay, we can leave it at medium. Let's do it. Okay. What? I didn't even read it! Bro, why you leave the door open? Bro, I didn't get to read the instructions. Why do I have a feeling someone's gonna peek out of the door? Get out of the pool. It's not gonna be a jump scare, right? <gasps> that's a flashlight, right? No, that's a flashlight. All of this letter finds you well. Your child is sick and needs your immediate attention. We should normally handle this matter, but the situation is urgent as we do not have a tele- Why is it not letting me read it? Okay, let's jump over that. Without a graphic, I ain't gonna get scared in this game, bro. I mean, uh, gotta admit, the sound is quite terrifying. Finally, after a 20-minute walk, we're actually at the building. Get inside. Okay. I'll be extra careful with the nun. Just uh, uh, hide some shadows from you. Okay, I think I read most of it. Oh my god. Bro. The game is so loud. I can't read this, bro. It's too it's too staticky. Interesting. So left click is applied. Gotcha. See, it's a crouch. Okay. These controls are pretty simple so far. How do we go in inventory? There's no inventory? Question mark? Question mark? Question mark? Alright, screw the inventory. Lighter. Oh my god. The lighter itself is loud as bull! Bro, I might actually have to reduce the volume. There's no way. Bro, what is. Bro, if it's this loud, imagine the jump scare. You, you, you know damn well, uh, bro. Okay. Toilet. I think it's kind of smart to leave the doors closed, just in case if she's, like, lurking in the shadows. Why is it getting stacky? It's getting staticky. <gasps> it's getting I'm making noise. Turn off my light. Bro, why is my screen shaking? Where am I even moving? Be a man! Oh, wait. <gasps> what is that? Gold, multiple objects, right? Okay, it looks to be. Bro, it's so loud. Plank. Why do I have a feeling she's around here? My heart. I'm assuming we place this here. So so uh, so far so good. Let's go through this door. Let's close this. Bro, he's dead. Listen, listen, listen. I'm a stealth kind of player. When it comes to horror games, I am the master at being stealthy. Hold up, hold up. So, my theory is, hold up, five more seconds, one, two, I think we're good, screw it, let's get out, oh my god, I threw it, okay, wait, no, that was on purpose, let's test if she can hear stuff, 
Okay, if she could, it was, that was a planned situation. We're gonna test. If she heard that, she would come here. If she doesn't come here, we know she doesn't hear stuff, so we could use that as an advantage to make noise, so we don't have to be as crouching or just running around or just walking over like rocks or glass or whatever that makes noises naturally. And then we had to test that out if that lures the creature or not. So let's see. Now we gotta keep note about like how fast is she? So like based on how long she takes to get here, let's see how fast she is. <laughs> oh yeah, I think she's coming. My screen is shaking. If she, uh, how about you speaking? If she comes here, can she find me? Let's give it like an extra five minutes. You know, it's been quite a while. Let's get out. Pick up this rock. I'm assuming this rock. Is Why is it? Why is this door is distorted? <laughs> One. <gasps> <Man! gasps> Glass door. Bro, this is too fucking obvious. <laughs> Bro, that is so loud. She's definitely coming. I'm not stupid. I watch horror movies. <laughs> I'm not stupid. Come on, just show yourself. I just need. For her to get along with her patrol rod, because I'm assuming, based on how the creature is made and created, she hears a noise. That's her new patrol route for a few minutes, and then she goes somewhere else, a part of the map. That's where. That's what I assume. Ain't no way. I'm staying here for an extra five minutes. I paid five bucks for this game. I can't be wasting my time. <gasps> I make so much noise. Does she hear that? Okay. One. Two. A vent. Can she crawl in vents? I doubt it. <gasps> ah! What was that? Did the way Is she in a vent? Bro, there's multiple pathways in a vent. That is super like Bro, she has to be in one of these vents. Bro, whoever, whoever made the blueprint for these vents, uh, why? <gasps> Bro, that sounded like a voice for a second. So I'm assuming we had to go back to that fan specifically when we turn off the power. I assume I'm getting like escape, escapist vibes. Let's go with this route. I am uh, physically mapping out the layout, <clears throat> so like, there's nothing. Why do I have? To... There's a bed here. So if I see here, I could just instantly hide in there. Why do I feel like she's in events with me? Like I doubt it because horror games are not that advanced, but. Bro, these vents are so damn big. It, it probably does fit her. And I forgot the layout. Wait, okay, wait, 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 I remember this. <gasps> Our whispers. <laughs> is she near me? Wait, is the game still? <gasps> oh my god, the game is still going. Wait, 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 okay, okay. Let's think about this. We haven't been here before because that door is locked. That's a new shower because I... How did she enter in if that door was... If that door was locked, how did she enter in the shower? Meaning she's capable of going through vents. If she's capable of going through vents, let's just wait out until she goes into that vent again so I can explore this. But knowing that this door is locked, we're going to have to go back into the vents to a different place. Meaning I'm going to... There's a 50-50 chance... That might come across her, but <gasps> it doesn't 
can't pause the game. That is so cruel. Okay, that confirms my another theory. We can hide in the open. <laughs> Bro, she whispered. Bro, it's so loud. No, 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 no. 